Okay, so what I'm doing here is uh, I've laid out the microfiber towels, and right here I have three towels. I've made my first cut, and I'm doing the same measurement width that I did for the flannel. And I want to do uh, three and uh, three quarter inches, so I'm going to count that out. And I know I'll have a little bit left over, but with um, a younger boy having small underwear, that cuts through so easy that you are going to wonder, hey, did I even get through all those layers? Um, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the excess for uh, the smaller the smaller boy. And like this one right here, I've got about five inches. You could even leave it that wide if you had um, bigger ones that you wanted to do. But uh, because of the size of our guy, and this is the next size off, um, that would go beyond the leg openings and I don't want that to wick out of the sides. And um, you can see like in the medium size how much wider it is. So that's why I was guessing um, that that three and three quarter measurement would do really well. So here's our three and three quarter measurement. And any scraps that you have also, keep in mind you can use them for making um, mama pads or um, nursing pads also. So I'm sure this will come in handy for something and uh, I'm just going to hang on to that. So now I've got my multiple layers here and what I'd like to do, um, because you don't want that microtary against the baby's skin, um, I'm going to layer them. What I'd like to do these are not uh, I've got that extra right there on the end. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fold that under so it's a little bit thicker at the one end of it and uh, get that all surged together. Yeah. So then I'm going to end up up in the front with a little bit thicker layers from that folding it under and hopefully that will help absorb some of anything that's uh, trying to leak out the front. Now if you had a girl, you could instead of um, cutting it that way. Uh, I've seen a lot of them where they're sewn together uh, here on this seam and then that becomes your doubling point. So maybe we'll make another tutorial in the future on how to make a uh, more absorbent girl doubler. So um, right here I've got two layers of microfiber, two layers of flannel. Uh, it's not real bulky but it'll be really absorbent. So I'm going to go ahead and serge my edges all together and uh, get these completed.